Hey everyone, it's Lindsay Ray here, and today I'm going to kind of do a video I haven't done before. It's a review, so, um, if I don't really know what to say, it's because I've never done one before, so it's new to me. And, um, let me know your opinions on what I talk, because I really, really want to know. Anyway, the review, as you can probably tell from the description or the title of the video up there, it is about hair chalking. Now, I've been noticing this trend like online, like on Twitter and Instagram, and I'm like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. It's like genius. Like, no, I don't want to color my hair every day a different color. Well, why not just use chalk? Awesome. Like, right? Seriously? So, um, Candy Johnson, which is my favorite like YouTuber ever, I just absolutely love her. She actually posted a video on how to um, chalk your hair. I was so excited. And um, me and my friend, Brittany, glitter up 88, um, we were like, oh my gosh, we have to try this. This is just so awesome. Like, hair chalking? Seriously? Like, that's crazy. Why didn't we ever think of that? And so um, we went to the store and um, we got hair chalk. And um, we were going to try it. And so I was so excited. So. I didn't do it the day I got it, but I did it the next day, and um, I did it, and I was just like, this is so cool, but after, I was like, wait, I don't really know if I like this or not, I'll just tell you why. So this is what the um, hair chalk looks like, It's you can just go to like a Michaels or like craft store, I got this at a Hobby Lobby, and you have to get artist chalk pastels, like the... Um, painter's chalk and I opened this side already it comes with like 48 different colors and um so basically you get um painter's chalk or artist chalk pastels or whatever and this one is only seven dollars so I think that's a pretty good deal anyway so you get that and what you do is you let's say I wanted to do this piece of hair I'll just take a like a squirt bottle and I'll wet this piece of hair I'm going to take the chalk and just basically chalk my hair. And then you can take, after that dries, you can take like a curling iron or a flat iron and you want to lock it in with heat. And so when I first did it, it was awesome. I was like, this is so cool. And um, then I started noticing that it made my hair really, really dry. And it makes your hair feel like it's in bunches of tangles. So I decided to comb it out. Not a good idea. Yeah, no, no, no. When you comb it out, all the chalk that's in that one strand gets all over your hair and it starts making your hair feel really, really dry and it makes your hair feel like it's all the way out here. It makes it feel like really, really big and dirty. It's really, really gross. And so I was like, oh, great. And um, so I was like, maybe I'll use a brush. Yeah, that didn't, that just made it even worse, <laughs> so that was not a good idea. I brushed it out and um, basically all the color went away and it was just like in my hair everywhere. So like I had one pink strand and the rest of my hair was just like pink. I didn't, I just was not a big fan of it. And um, so yeah, I didn't like that and um, Another con, I guess, is um, if you are a dummy and you brush it out or comb it out, it will stick to your brushes. And I did not realize this till I started doing my hair today. Yes, I started doing it and I noticed some pink particles in my hair. I was like, what is that? And then um, I started noticing the dryness again that I got um, yesterday. Yesterday I did this chalking thing. And I forgot I did not clean my brushes, so you want to do that because it gets everywhere. And um, let's see, another con, another con. Um, hmm. Look, just the basic thing is it just really, really makes your hair dry. That's the only thing I did not like about it. If it didn't make your hair dry, I would do it all the time. Um, I'll probably still continue to do this every once in a while, but there's no way I would do it more than once a week because it really damages your hair. It really, really does. So, um, if you are into the whole chalking thing like I am or was, 
then go, totally go for it. It probably works for um, other people than me. Maybe that's just my opinion. But um, maybe you can tell me some ways that I can maybe um, not get my hair so dry and still use the chalk. Because I, I really, really like, you know, the different colors in my hair. So um, if you have any, like, tips or tricks on how I can do it, then please let me know. But all I... Um, all the tips I have for you is if you do this, just really, really make sure to deep condition your hair after and to not brush it out like I did. Oops. <laughs> but thank you for sticking and, um, sticking. That did not make sense. Thank you for sticking around and watching this video. Yes, that's what I meant. And, um, try it. Try this out. It's so fun. It really, really is fun. Just be careful of how you do it and, um, how much you use. So, um, yes, if you have any requests on videos that you would like me to do, let me know. Otherwise, I'll just talk with you guys later. Bye.